Revolution returns home after another tough trip, which saw New England lose a lead and then the match. Now the Reds must find a way to earn points and quickly as the season heats up towards the playoffs. Here is Darius Barnes. He goes from center back to left back, allowing Chris Tierney to get into the midfield. Forward Carlos Coastley. Reds have to watch Brad Davis, number 11. He has It'll be Houston kicking off, moving from right to left, wearing their orange uniforms, the Reds in their home blues. Michael Kennedy, the referee, whistles the opening to proceedings here. Intensity has to be high. I know Steve Nichol downplayed it, but they really got to be flying out there if you're the Revs. And then set pieces, both offensively and defensively, you have to watch out. Brad Davis, number 11 for the Houston Dynamo, will put excellent balls in. Everyone has to be marked. Here's Mansali after Milton Caraglio let it bounce. Mansali playing on the deck, but he was hauled to the ground. And it will be a free kick from a more advantageous position than the last one. It will be Tierney, gets it up, he gets it down, it's off the post. Inches from a first goal for the Revs. Terrific strike, just curled a little too much. What a strike from Chris Tierney. He did everything right, gets it up and over the wall. You look at this, you can see this ball go up and over, it's just bending, and you said it, Brad, a little bit too much rotation. The quick corner here. Back to fail, Hopper, his delivery, bounces. Ball off his line, misplays an open goal, and it's 1-0. The Reds have scored the most unlikely goal scorer, Ryan Cochran, against his former club. Well, it's the dream start for the Revolution. Set pieces, I said, were going to be important. There's a quick corner, heads up play from Benny Fellhaber and Chris Tierney link up on the sideline. And then here, this ball gets down. Milton Caraglio stays with it. He's able to spite off two players and a good defensive play, and it falls to Brian Cochran, back post. Look at Caraglio, keep this alive. Terry Hall, Telly Hall comes up, makes the first save, but then it's right to Ryan Cochran sitting there. One of the easiest goals Ryan Cochran will ever score, Brad. Of course, he lost two MLS Cup Finals and won a Super League Final against the Dynamo. Davis's delivery headed across the face of goal and cleared off of the line. Kevin Olsen with an important play there for the Revs. Very heady from Kevin Alston. It's all about your position on that back post. You can't overcommit, and Kevin Alston stands his ground. Moffitt, space in front of him. Have another long range go and force another good save by Matt Reese. Again, Moffitt scored a 40 yard bomb against Portland that they're saying could be a goal of the year candidate, and he was closer on that shot than he was on his last one here. Adam Moffat coming up with a heat check. He just steps over. He's feeling confident with his shot. That's the second one tonight, but you're right. He is reeling from his game at home against Portland where he scored what potentially could be the goal of the year. Well, they're, they're just going against the grain, and so Kevin Olsen gives it up. He has to get back. But that was Ryan Cochran actually read that well because, like you mentioned, there was a break, and, and Brad Davis just missed that ball to the, to the running Watson. Davis is out, swinger, free header, and another save by Reese. Big Cam Weaver, that's the danger we talked about, and D.A. was just uh, referring to. Well, I'm telling you right now, it, I have never seen Brad Davis put so many good balls and in. That's Jeff Cameron. Ball. Jeff Cameron, it, yeah. It is Jeff Cameron up and over the bar. Matt Reese makes the save. But look at the precision from Brad Davis. Every ball he's putting in there is so difficult to defend. There's movement on it. Matt Reese can't come forward. He's got to make the save. So in the final 40 or so seconds, the first half here, Moffitt. Davis again on the right side. Hano. Plays it in behind. Taylor squares it. Oh, how is that not a goal? I'll tell you what, Cam Weaver somehow spooned that over the bar. Great ball from Andre Hayno as this goes in. Has eyes, beats Zach Boggs, and then he's sitting on the six inside the four. And actually, the flag was up. You can see he came into play there. Cam Weaver, Cam Weaver was offside. Wouldn't have been a goal. Cochran having a nice match, you know, has the goal, but also defensively helping his teammates out. Delivery for Weaver, his header across the face of goal, soars. Now Watson shoots, and Ching unable to redirect it. And the Revs again living dangerously in their own 18. Uh, well, they are, and this was another fall into the box, back post, and it's Cam Weaver nods it back down. A.J. Soar's there. 
But look at this shot as it comes across. Watson tries to put it on frame. It's almost one of those cross shots, and Brian Ching just missed it. Back to Freeman. Newsom circulating it left to right. Moffitt with an opportunity to cross off of the back of Failhaber. Knocked down, and the shot beaten away by Reese. Another terrific save by the Revolution netminder. Matt Reese is keeping the Revs in this game. I mean, I don't know how many times they're going to say it, but Matt Reese just in the zone. Look at his ability to keep his body up. That ball was so difficult, and Cameron strikes that. Matt Reese can't even see it, and he waits the last minute, uses his forearm to parry it away. But that's what you want in a veteran keeper. Matt Reese at the top of his game. Barnes ball for Caraglio, won by Houston. Benny got a foot to it. The Dynamo have it again, sprayed wide for Davis. Taylor, good ball in, Weaver's header. Reese again, playing the role of the brick wall in front of the Revolution goal. Not sure if that was ticketed for inside the far post as the Houston Dynamo saw it, but he did the job. Well, Taylor, good ball. And really, look, yeah, I think that's going in, and Matt Reese bangs himself up against his post. But yeah, look that's at this. a save. That is a save, and that's going in, and Matt Reese sacrificing his body. He's got to get to it. Look at his right, his left shoulder hits the post. With the likes of Cameron, what? Weaver, and Coastley as big targets in the box. Hanos forward, Boswell, the outswinger, the header saved by Reese. Second ball tapped in, and it's 1 1. A calamitous moment for the New England Revolution. Houston celebrates. The Reds have conceded late here. And Jay, you hate to say it, but that is a backbreaker of a play for the Reds, not just in terms of the season, uh, the, the game, but also the season, perhaps. Oh, wow, Matt Reese makes the save. But it's Boswell who just sitting there. Look at this good header. It's costly that gets up for it. Matt Reese is on in hand there. Three Houston players and no Revs players there. And okay, let's things continue. The Revs can't string passes together. And it's not clear that everybody's on the same page right now. They hear the final minutes. A gratuitous hit there by Moffitt and Reese. Still not done with the Houston midfielder.